If you are an artist, chances are you're always looking for ways to stay ahead of the curve. After all, the art world is constantly changing and evolving, and you need to do everything you can to keep up. Luckily, there's one tool that can help you do just that. AI webcams. And yes, you heard me right. AI webcams are becoming more and more popular among artists because they offer a whole host of benefits from helping you document your work in a more engaging and immersive way to an expanded field of view to help your viewers see all of your work from all angles to help you gain an artist's edge in the market today. My friends at OK Labs were kind enough to send me their 4K AI auto framing webcam to try out and I was so excited to put this camera under some extreme test conditions. <laughs> where you can see the features and the benefits of AI webcams and why they're so desirable for artists as opposed to just regular old webcams. And as you may know, AI webcams really can set you back a pretty penny. But one of the reasons why I continue to love working with Okio Labs is they always send me products that are really high quality with a price that is reasonable that anyone can afford. So without further ado, here are nine ways artists are using AI webcams to stay ahead of the curve. Number one, sharing a large body of artwork or creative work in your space. As an artist, you may have a large body of work that you want to share with your audience, but you don't always have the space to display everything at once. <laughs> As artists, it can be nearly impossible to share your work with your online community if you're just constantly trying to adjust the camera for them to see. Paintings, sculptures, or even a stage setup before a performance may be vital for your colleagues, partners, museums, galleries, or investors to see. Ideally, you would love to walk around your space and naturally show your work without constantly trying to reframe the camera. Yet with the auto frame feature on the Okia Labs A10, not only will the camera auto frame you, but it's also gonna auto frame where your hands are. The tripod that comes with the A10 is also extremely helpful in getting a clear view of everything in your space without having to worry about moving the camera around. This is great when you wanna share your work as the camera will follow your movements and ensure that everything is in frame. And if you're wanting to show a large space with many works of art, you can switch the auto frame feature off and use the 100 125 degree wide angle lens and it will capture the entire space. Number two, filming a creative process video. So art, dance, theater, yoga, cooking, time lapses, whatever it may be. <laughs> it can be really fun and informative to film a process video for your audience. They not only get to see the final product, but also how you got there. With the Okia Labs A10, you can set the camera up on its tripod in your space and let it do its thing while you work. The AI feature is really great for keeping you in the frame as you move around, and you can even use the 125 degree wide angle lens to capture more of your workstation. Another option is to film your process from beginning to end by utilizing the Okia Labs' Time Lapse app, which works great for longer processes, such as painting a mural. By recording a time lapse, you can watch the development of your project at super speed. Number three, filming art lessons, courses, or virtual art tutorials. This may be similar to number two, but teaching art is very different than making art. When I used to teach in-class private school art lessons, I would set up my easel and have my students stand behind me to watch my process. If I needed to move around or stand up or lift my painting, it just, it wasn't a problem. <laughs> Yet now I specialize in teaching beginner artists how to paint realistic portraits through my online courses. And the process of teaching through recorded classes is a completely different animal than in-person teaching. Not only do I have to create the curriculum and paintings, but I also have to worry about the audio, the filming, and the editing and consistently interrupt my painting process to check and make sure that everything is in frame while painting. For my course, Realistic Portraits for Beginners, I painted all six portrait demonstrations using a document camera. So this meant that I actually had all demonstrations on a flat surface, which can be quite challenging for painting portraits because the whole perspective is warped for me when I'm looking at it. If I had an AI camera like the A10, I could have painted my portrait demonstrations on an easel and been able to get the entire painting process on my easel in frame. And the tripod really is a game changer for anyone teaching because you can just put your camera anywhere it needs to go. This specific camera can also be adjusted very easily by tilting it up, down, or all around. If someone teaches any type of creative course, an AI web camera really can be a game changer for you. Number four, live streaming gallery openings, museum galas, or other art events. 
I'm gonna say it a lot in here, but live streaming is a really great way to connect with your audience and give them a front row seat to your event. So what better way to connect with your audience than letting them join the party? The Okio Labs A10 is perfect for live streaming events as it can be placed on a tripod and left to its own devices. The AI feature ensures that you will always be in frame and the 125 degree wide angle lens ensures that your entire event will be captured. Whether you're live streaming a gallery opening, a museum gala, or any type of art event, the A10 is a really great tool to make sure you just capture the entire scene. Number five, making a stop motion film. Stop motion films are such a fun and creative way to tell a story. I had a little stop motion set that I made a long time ago, but I had never been able to use it or test it out until now. So I wanted to see if the artificial intelligence feature on the Okio Labs A10 camera would work with stop motion. So I put it to the test. Unfortunately, it didn't work the way that I wanted it to. <laughs> so I had to switch it to the regular wide angle camera mode and record it normally just using their fun and free app. Number six, streaming musical or theatrical performances. If you're looking to live stream a musical or a theatrical performance, an AI webcam is a great option. This is the sound for the microphone in the camera. Normally you have to film a musical or a theatrical performance from the nosebleed section, which completely eliminates any of the excitement of the performance. However, because the Okio Labs A10 has a 125 degree wide angle lens, the tripod with extendable legs and two internal microphones, you can bring the webcam closer to the action and guarantee a far superior immersive live streaming experience. Number seven, conducting interviews, artist collaborations, and podcasts. Nowadays, the community of artists we interact with is no longer limited by geographic boundaries. The internet has allowed us to connect with other creatives from all over the world and allow us to follow mentors, artists, and thought leaders who share our values. It's easier now more than ever, <laughs> more than ever, to create and collaborate with fellow artists, and often we do this through our personalized channels and our social media platforms. And as artists, we are finding more ways to reach our audiences by filming or live streaming our interviews before we turn them into podcasts, blogs, articles, or what have you. With the extendable tripod legs, you can place the webcam at any angle or height, and with the artificial intelligence feature, you never have to worry that you or your guests are gonna be out of frame. Number eight, streaming art auctions. Ah, art auctions! If you're an artist who sells your work through art auctions, or maybe you're an auction house or an art investor, an AI webcam can be a great way to give your audience a front row seat to the action. So you can live stream the entire auction so that your viewers can feel like they're right there in the room with you. And this is not only beneficial to those who are running the auctions, but it also allows viewers from around the world to get a feel or like a heat map of those ready to bid. The A10's AI features will make sure that you're always in frame and the wide angle lens just have the ability to capture the entire room and all of the excitement of the auction. Last, but certainly not least, connect with your audience. As an artist, your audience is everything. Without them, you would not be able to do the things that you love for a living. And that's why it's so important to find ways to connect with your audience and give them a behind the scenes look at your art process or perhaps a tour of your creative space. And being able to interact with your audience live just breaks that fourth wall. And what I mean by this is that it allows you to connect with them on a personal level and build a really strong rapport and connection. And what better way to do this than to open your doors to your world just for a little bit of time. The Okia Labs A10 is a really great tool to give your audience a tour of your creative space or process because I really like the wide angle lens and of course me like trying to move around my space. They're just able to get a better feel of what it's like to be there. If you're intrigued by the Okia Labs A10 webcam, I've included a link below. And if your portrait paintings don't look quite realistic enough for your personal taste, my most popular course, Realistic Portraits for Beginners, as I mentioned before, could be exactly what you need. It's often not a lack of talent or style that holds us back from painting our dream portraits, but rather just a few simple tweaks of our painting process that really makes all the difference. So there you have it. Those are nine ways that you can use an AI webcam like the Okia Labs A10 to improve your art practice. Thank you so much. See you next time. Bye.